Hello fellow humans, I'm Peter Bois. I have had the Secret Labs Titan Soft Weave gaming chair for a few weeks and unfortunately, I'm sending it back. I'll tell you why in detail in this review. First, before we get into the details, I want to say that everybody's body is different, so my experience may not be typical. In fact, I think my experience is an outlier because I watched and read a ton of reviews on the Secret Lab chairs before I bought mine, and they were all extremely positive. Okay, let's get into it. My chair is the 2021 Secret Lab Titan Soft Weave and cost $449 with free delivery. The Secret Lab makes three different sized chairs, the Omega, which is the smallest, the middle sized, which is called the Titan, which is the one I have, and the Titan XL, which is the largest. First, the positives. The chair is very well made. It's heavy and has a quality feel to every part of the chair. I think it would last a very long time. The seat and armrest adjustments work great as well. I love the soft weave fabric and the aesthetics of the chair. The foam the seat is made up is very comfortable. When you first sit in it though, you may think this is too hard, but after an hour or more, you'll appreciate the firmness of how your butt never goes all the way through the cushion to the hard chair underneath. It has a lot of things going for it. The problems I have with it are in the geometry and the fit. The seat angle is too steep and cuts off the circulation to my legs below my knee and causes sore spots in the back of my thighs. The front of the seat is a full two inches higher than the back where your butt goes. Because of this angle, when I sit back in the chair, the front of the chair presses up on the back of my legs, causing poor circulation to my legs. To me, this is a strange design choice. I imagine I'm not the only one experiencing this. In fact, I did a search and found a Reddit thread with others experiencing this exact issue. Also, when I work, I often like to sit on the edge of the chair, and because of the angle, it makes sitting on the edge of the chair uncomfortable because it's not level. I wish they would have went with a level seat. I believe this would make a huge difference. My other complaint is with the back of the chair. I think this complaint may be less relevant for most people than my other one because I have a history of back pain in some chairs where other people don't. When I sit all the way back in the chair, the curve of the chair sticks out at my shoulder blades and causes pain in that exact spot. Also, if I were to rest my head back on the headrest, it curves my spine backwards, causing neck pain as well as back pain. The chair does have an adjustable lumbar support, but adjusting this hasn't solved any of these problems for me. These two issues have caused me enough discomfort and pain to return the chair. Their customer service at Secret Labs has been very helpful though in returning my chair, so I give them five stars for that. To wrap up this review, I cannot recommend the Secret Lab Titan due to those reasons. Again, everybody's body is different and you may love this chair after trying it. The problem with buying a chair online is you can't try it beforehand. And I'm not even sure if I were able to sit in this chair before I bought it, I would have caught these issues as it takes a few days of sitting in a chair to really get a feel for it. So my search for a chair continues. If you liked the video, please drop a like on it, subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any future videos. Thank you for watching. See you next time.